come to the Department of Biological Sciences, which is one of the departments within the School of Biological, Physical, Mathematics and Actual Sciences. Biological Sciences basically deals with the zoology and botany. Zoology is the study of animals, while botany is the study of plants. So welcome our first years and may I take this opportunity to first congratulate you for being admitted to Jaramogi Ogingo Dinga University of Science and Technology. My name is Dr. Sito Stephen Amolo. I'm the chairman of the Department of Biological Sciences. I'm a PhD holder. I specialize in cell and molecular biology. Within the school, we have a faculty of 13. So we have a professor of botany. We have three associate professors, two senior lecturers, and the rest of the faculty have PhDs. Within the department, we offer several courses. One of the courses which we offer at undergraduate level is what we, we refer to as Bachelor of Science in Biological Sciences. And this is basically to prepare the students to be scientists. It is a four-year course which involves fieldwork. It also involves practical. There's also the aspects of theory. And we also have industrial attachment basically to expose the students to the environment within industries. At postgraduate level, we also offer several courses, including Master of Science in Plant Ecology, Master of Science in Applied Insect Science, Master of Science in Microbiology, PhD in Applied Insect Science, which some, in some universities is referred to as entomology, which includes both agricultural and medical entomology. We also offer a PhD in microbiology and also a PhD in plant ecology. This is a school which is evolving and we are also developing additional programs to make sure that we meet the standards that is required of universities. In terms of our research equipments, the, the department has four teaching and research labs and one of the teaching and research labs that we have is what we are calling the Molecular and Microbiology Lab. Within the lab, we have several equipments, including microscopes. We also have what we call lamina flow hood. Lamina flow hood enables the students to carry out experiments under sterile conditions. And this is one of the equipments that the university acquired as a result of funding that the department got from national research funds. In addition, we also have for storage of our reagents and samples, we have fridges and we have a fridge which also has a deep freezer negative 20 for storage of samples. We also have a water bath. We also have what we are calling a magnetic star for mixing. We have centrifuges. Let's look at the opportunities available for students undertaking Bachelor of Science in Biological Sciences. There are a lot of opportunities for students taking Biological Sciences, especially in the research field. So if you are doing Bachelor of Science in Biological Sciences, you have a chance to get employed in the key research institutions in this country, including Kenya Medical Research Institute. There's also Kenya Agricultural and Livestock Research Organization, CALRO. There is also the opportunity for you to get employed in the national museums and within the national museums you can also do a lot of research, especially if you go to the Institute of Primate Research. There is also the opportunity of our students getting employed in international research organizations such as the Centers for Disease Control and the Walter Reed or US Army Military Research Units. Apart from opportunities within the research, the students also have the opportunity to work in industries. For example, they can work in food industries, including brewing industries. They can also work in industries, milk processing industries. The students also have the opportunity to work in other industries which are producing food products. Apart from industries, 
students who have done Bachelor of Biological Sciences have the opportunity because biological science is basically is a basic science, so it can act for, as a springboard for a student, especially if the student in, is interested in doing other prof professional courses such as medicine, or if the student wants to be a teacher, he can now do postgraduate diploma in education, and he'll be employed by TS, Teacher Service Commission as a teacher. The other opportunities for the student is that the students have the opportunity to advance their studies, and there are several fields where the students can advance their studies and one of the fields which the students can now do postgraduate studies is what we call master of science in microbiology the, we also have opportunities in master of science in plant ecology master of science in applied insect science or entomology the students also have the opportunity of doing master of science in biochemistry bioinformatics and system biology or compu computational biology conservation and restoration ecology, parastology. There are several fields which the students can do and later this will also either they can do PhD in these specific fields and either get employed as lecturers or join research organizations as researchers. The other opportunity for students is that because a lot of students will be engaged in practical aspects as they are being taught within the four years they'll be introduced a lot of practical aspects, be it in beekeeping, because beekeeping is one of the subjects which we, we tackle under arthropod biology or insect science. The students also have the opportunity to learn things like mushroom farming, which can also enable the student to start their self-employment, especially if they are students who are entrepreneurs. What are the research interests of the faculty within the school? The faculty of this in school is involved in various research activities. For example, there are those who are carrying out research in immunology, and in immunology, basically, they are looking at the interactions between pathogen and the human immune system with the ultimate aim of developing vaccines. There's also faculty, members of the faculty who are interested in plant ecology, plant physiology, plant genetics, and plant breeding. There's also members of this faculty who are interested, who are doing a lot of research in insect science, that is entomology. There's also members of this school who are also carrying a lot of research in microbiology and bioinformatics. And the advantage of this is that the students during your four year stay within the university will be interacting with this faculty, which which has a diverse array of abilities and this will basically help you to develop as a research scientist. With all this, we welcome you to our department and we are looking forward that within the four years you'll have a wonderful time within the university and you'll keep on interacting with the faculty so that at the end of the four years you'll have gained a lot as a student and joined the Kenyan workforce. Thank you.